Hello guys, how are you? I hope so, now we are going to talk about, 2022 Ford Fiesta van also gets a facelift, but before I have to ask you to subscribe and leave your like, let's go to the video. We usually associate the words Ford and van with the comprehensive transit lineup of workhorses, but in some parts of Europe, there's a smaller utilitarian model slotting below the likes of the Transit Connect or the more compact Tourneo Connect. Yes, the Fiesta van is sticking around for 2022 and benefits from the same styling and design tweaks applied to the regular Super Mini. It's still a three-door, two-seat affair, but now with Matrix LED headlights featuring a glare-free high beam function. The pint-sized van even comes in two different trim levels, Trend and Sport each featuring its own exterior styling traits and individual will designs. Not only is the Fiesta the only B-segment hatchback still offered on the old continent without rear doors, but it's also the sole super mini-based van after the Corsavan was axed a few years ago, customers will be able to get one with glorious 15-inch steel wheels or upgrade to alloys available up to 18 inches in size. Boundless blue and beautiful berry join the color palette, and there are black surrounds for the taillights. The blue oval at the front now sits on the grille, which is slightly bigger to enable greater road presence. Already a rather unusual vehicle, the Fiesta van can be ordered with a sports suspension that lowers the ride height a bit. Inside, Ford is offering a two-tone red and ebony trim with red stitching while the seats are more comfortable than before thanks to a new foam. There's enough room behind them for items up to 1,283 mm, 50.5 inches, long while the load volume measures 0.96 cubic meters, 33.9 cubic feet. The little van offers a maximum payload capacity of 531 kilograms, 1,170 pounds. Much like the standard Super Mini, the Fiesta van will be powered exclusively by a 1.0-liter EcoBoost engine with or without a mild hybrid setup and producing nearly 125 horsepower. In some markets, the car will be offered with an E85 fuel-compatible powertrain, meaning the engine will run on 85% ethanol and 15% gasoline. So that's it guys, comment what you think of this article, and don't forget to click like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.